the soil super stakes, the 2018 super stakes. And tonight we had the limited open derby decided. That was taken out by Lance Cooper. Congratulations to you, Lance. Thank you. Well, what a great result, 223. How are you feeling? Feeling awesome. It was a great run. Just thankful everybody come out and watch and just a good feeling. Now, you were the first out yes, and you set the bar with that 223. Um, did you think it was a winner? Did you think it was going to stick? Did it feel good? It felt good, but you never know being first. You just, there's 12 horses behind us and anybody can do it in this class. It, mayor felt good and everything felt like it was a winning run, but you really don't know until it's all over. Okay, so describe your run to us. Put us there in the action. What did it feel like on each cow? Well, I showed the mare twice already, and I didn't make the semis in the open, and so I made the limited. And she's been good all week. I just haven't showed as aggressive, I feel like, in the open. And tonight, Austin Shepard just said, come up and show like you normally do, and that really helped me. And then I come up and showed really aggressive tonight, and cows loved. Cows were good, and it just worked out. Which cows did you choose? Did did your dad, Michael Cooper, help with that? Uh, yes, my dad helps me choose my cows. Also, Steve Olaf and R.L. Chartier. Steve Olaf is in my corner. He also settled my cattle tonight. And my first cow was a black mock horn cow that was on my first cut, and I auctioned off on her. I was trying to cut just like a gray brown top earlier, and I auctioned off to that black horn cow, and she was good. Now, you rode Zen and Tonic just a few months ago in the limited non-pro futurity and uh, won that title, shared it. Uh, that was the non-pro. Now you're in the open. Tell us about that. <laughs> yes. Uh, she was aired in the open. And she's been good all year, and so we decided to enter in the open, and we really didn't know who was going to show her, and we didn't really know, so a lot of people asked me to show her and talk to Dad about it. He says, it's my choice. I can have an open rider show her or I can show her. And my dad's never showed her before and no one else has. And I was like, can I just show her since she's been good for me? And he said yes. And so that's what happened. Okay. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. You've won about 180000 Yes, ma'am. And the horses won about 100000 Yes, ma'am. Okay. A large chunk of that you've done together, correct? Yes, ma'am. All this year. How, how much of that this year? 100000 this year on her. Wow. So tell us then, what makes this such a successful partnership? I don't know. She's just an unbelievable mare. She goes out there and does her best every time. She's so smart about a cow. And she just loves to cut. I couldn't say anything better about her. Are we going to be seeing more of you in the open? I don't know about that. I show tomorrow in the non-pro, so hopefully. It's fun. But it was just a practice run, really, for the non-pro. A bit more pressure in the open? A lot more pressure in the <laughs> open. A lot better people. A lot more... Just a lot more, I don't know, just harder, I guess. Okay, now we've mentioned Dad. We've got to mention Mum because you can't, you can't do this without your Mum. And she's been working hard on the other side of this camera, organising the webcast. What's your message to her? Oh, well, my mom and Mark Michaels put a photo up on me tonight that I really didn't know what... I don't even know what they put a photo up, and it was like a picture from two years ago in the youth finals, and... It was pretty, I was pretty, I don't know, I didn't know what to say about it. <laughs> well, you felt a bit uncomfortable? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> okay, but I'm sure you got a message of love for your mum right now, Oh, don't you? oh yes. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. And it would be fun watching you continue to, to show this horse. One more question, actually. Um, how has this horse developed since the futurity in the time that you've had it? Oh, she's just gotten smarter every time I show her, really. She gets better after, like, every run, like... She keeps on getting smarter, keeps on getting smarter. And I can't say enough about that mare. She's been so good for me all year. All right, we're going to continue to enjoy watching you together. Thanks very much, Lance. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Lance Cooper. Tomorrow we're going to have uh, the non-pro Open Derby go-rounds, so stay watching. That's it for tonight, folks, but tune in tomorrow morning on the live CHC webcast. Good night.